The other day I held up a one sheet, which is like a sales sheet for one of our programs. And I showed somebody on our team that, and this person said, oh gosh, I can't believe that sales sheet from so many years ago. And it was a different type of program. It was actually called Build Your Author Empire. And it was not the best thing. Let's just put it that way. Here's the point. When I look at that, I don't think, oh gosh, look at that. I actually like it. I actually smile. I actually have gratitude. And here's why. You need to enjoy the process. So many times we think that the first time we do something, it's going to be perfect. It's going to just roll out absolutely gold. But the reality is it takes oftentimes, many times, for it to have iterations. So the point is this, that the thing that you're about to launch, it may be the thing that puts you on the map for influence, for impact, maybe even for income. But you know what? It might not be. It might be a stone in the process as you build up this amazing thing that you're creating. Don't detest. Don't don't look upon the work that you've done as anything more than part of the process. It's excellent. So I don't look at the old videos that I did, the old logos that I had, the old products, the old programs. I don't look upon that with disgust. I actually think, you know what? Awesome. It was where I was in that moment of time. Give yourself grace. Give yourself today the gift of enjoying the process. Because I'll tell you what, one of these days you are going to have that amazing product, amazing program, great talk, whatever it is, ministry, you name it. And you're going to launch that thing and it's going to be fantastic. This is Carrie Oberbrunner, Be a Soul on Fire. I believe in you. Take care.